Welcome back to another Unreal Engine tutorial. So, uh, someone asked me to uh, create a um, retarget or a first person retarget uh, tutorial. Um, but I do it in a little other way. So, I think he meant it like this. Um, so, here is the normal first person template in Unreal Engine 5. So you can see just normal, you can choose, go around, and everything just in the template. And here are my arms. So basically a custom arm rigged with the epic skeleton. So you can see it has its own skeleton, but it is in the epic rig. Alright, so let's go into the first person blueprints. And basically, we do this now with a master pose component. So what is a master pose component? It's basically, yeah, you can just call it live retargeting or something else. So it's basically um, um, grabs the animation from one mesh and retargets them live while you are in the game on top of other skeletic mesh. So let me show you this real quick. Here is our first person character. So under the first person mesh we create a scene and we call the scene the visual meshes. So under the visual message, meshes uh, we create another skeletic mesh and call this my arms. So for the skeletical mesh here, I go with my arms, like so. So now they are here. Let's go into the construction script and grab our first person mesh. Let's drag the pin off and say set master post component and plug this into new master post component. And the target is our my arms skeletical mesh. So plug that in, go to viewport and hit compile. And now you can see that our my arms here uh, playing the same animation as the first person mesh here. So now we can click on our first person mesh, go to visibility and untick visible. So now you can see here that my arms are playing this animation. So let's play and you can already see here are my arms. And yeah, everything should work fine now. And yeah, there was a little tutorial how to use master post component. I hope everything is not clear now. And um, yeah, when you want to, uh, or when you have multiple meshes or want a modular character, then you can basically just um, add another skeletal mesh, another visceral meshes, meshes here. And for example, this is my, these are my arms, and these are now my gloves. So I want to uh, a character customization where I have gloves, or where you can. Uh, apply gloves to your arms or not. And then you just create a new skeletic mesh here, uh, set the skeletic mesh here, go to the construction script and just hook them up into the target again. So, yeah. This was the tutorial. I hope you liked it and uh, yeah, go on with your project and I hope you all of you, all of you have a good day. So, bye bye.